The greatest winner in NBA history, 11-time champion Bill Russell with the Boston Celtics. Let me just tell you real quick, I know he's not really the most popular player, but this build is insane, and it fits Bill Russell's play style to a T. Just check this out. You, Michael Jordan, Will, you have to pick one person. Who do you pick? Well, uh, you pick Bill Russell. The way I play, my team wins. What we do here is go back, 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 back. back. So let me just explain. I've been grinding this build maybe for a week and a half. Not like all day every day, but just here and there grinding it to get it to 99.9, get all the badges and whatnot. And let me tell you, I have never got more snatch blocks on a build in my entire life. You guys saw all those snatch blocks. I mean, that's in about that's not like I've been playing all year and I got those snatch blocks. Like I said, it's only been a week or two to get those snatch blocks. Just check out the attributes on this legend 99.9 overall Bill Russell build. I mean you get 88 driving dunk, 88 standing dunks. You get all the contact dunks. You get the big man contacts, the elite contacts, and the pro contacts. Now, look at the shooting. A 39 mid-range and a 52 three-pointer. Now, the only reason I upgraded the three-pointer was because I just wanted to mess around and see what I could do with it. Obviously, Bill Russell, they didn't even have a three-point line back then, so it's not like he was shooting threes. But just for this build, I upgraded the three-pointer to mess around with it. But you're going to see. If you don't think it can shoot, just wait and watch this first gameplay. Even with the 39 mid-range, just check this out. All right, so you see the pass accuracy, the ball handling, decent, whatever. You could say he should have a little bit of post moves, but he didn't really. Bill Russell wasn't really much of a scorer, so it doesn't matter. Now, the defensive stats, I mean, oh, my God. The lowest stat is 80 lateral quickness. Everything else is like 99, 86, 93. It's ridiculous how good this build is on defense. It's the perfect build to play center with on threes or fives i'm telling you the defense is incredible we'll talk about more of that later 20 finishing badges as you can see you know we got the lob city finisher contact finisher fancy all the stuff you would want maybe you don't want put back maybe you want like relentless or something but i put put back to try to get some put back dunk clips and uh things like that shooting badges i go gold catch and shoot gold quick draw silver range extender silver corner and then bronze hot zone hunter obviously Put whatever you want but i feel like those fit really well with, with this build playmaking badges got to have the break starter needle threader quick first step bail out and unpluckable on bronze 40 yes 40 defensive badges i mean you can put it on wherever you want depending on the game mode if you're playing like 1v1 court maybe you want to take one of them down and put up like moving truck or something or maybe you want pickpocket or it all depends what type of player you're playing against you know maybe you don't need interceptor it all depends listen Overall, the build is insane. These gameplays are ridiculous. I have two quick gameplays that's gonna show you all aspects of this build. The only thing that's tough to show is the defense because we're on the twos. And if you don't give up the ball, you don't have to play defense. But as you saw from that, you know, the intro clips, the build covers ground. He's so fast. He snatch blocks all over the place. You saw the defensive ratings. Defensively, it's the best build. I think to guard the to play center with to guard pick and roll because you can hedge up and get to the guard once your guard recovers you're so fast you can run back chase down the center get chased down blocks snatch blocks contest rebound you know offensively your rolls are super quick because you have 87 speed and you know great acceleration and all that type of stuff let's get right into the game placement if you haven't already drop a like on the video I know Bill Russell's not the most popular player out there but this build is ridiculous on NBA 2K20, all right? So 
first, you know, I'm playing with my boy Supreme, so we're running pick and roll and whatnot, you know, screens, rolls, all that type of stuff. You can even pop off it, honestly, but I mean, if that center steps up, which this center isn't because he's playing terrible defense, but if that center steps up to hedge the guard, you're so much faster than other big men. You're going to be open on the roll every time because, you know, you're just so much faster than other bigs. But look at hop step, dunk all over him. All right, so this first gameplay, I'm going to show you that that 39 mid-range and the 52 three-pointer is more than enough. Look at Supreme kicks it to me. It's green. Now we end up giving up the ball. Supreme gets the steal. I'm going to run to the corner, kicks it to me. I dribble in. You get reverse dunk packages, contact dunk packages, everything you could want. I also want to mention in this video, Supreme is on a new player he's on a 90 overall so he, did, he doesn't have a lot of playmaking badges he does not have floor general and he does not have dimer now you might not believe me or whatever but i mean i i guess i should have showed you his player card but i promise you he doesn't have it and with a 39 mid range you just saw me green a mid a deep mid at that okay and that's not the end of it okay that's not the end of it remember i'm not cutting anything right here i'm letting this whole sequence play out so you could see that uh you know we're just out here greening now he does have playmaking takeover now which is going to help my shot but still it's a 52 three ball and we're greening up that's multiple greens that's three greens in one game okay and we're not done check it out dex corner catch another mid-range with a 39 mid-range green now like i said at this point in the game he does have his takeover which does help me shoot but it's still, my, my mid-range is in the 30s, and we're greening, okay? So as long as you got badges, that's all you need. I talked about it in my last video. Hop, step, dunk. All right, so 21-0. First game on Bill Russell. I just wanted to show you that. You might see the shooting ratings and be like, ah, there's no way I could play on that build. Listen, I know you're all not legends, but if you can find a way to get badges on him, maybe upgrading the free throw a little bit more, post-fade, whatever. If you can get some badges on this build, you can shoot, okay? I mean, I didn't upgrade my mid-range at all. I have a 39 from the plus five from being 99.9 .9, and we're out here greening. So now second game, I want to show you what can it do attacking the basket? I told you, you know, in terms of centers to have all the contact dunks is rare, but to be this fast, this athletic and all that, this good defensively still be able to shoot and get lobs, contact dunks, all that type of stuff. This build is one of a kind, man. It's one of a kind. I absolutely love it. It's one of my favorite builds to play on now. Look at just boom all over him, bro. All over him. I'm pure red pie chart, straight defense. And we have this type of offensive game. It's insane. And that's not it. We're not done. Now, honestly, I made this build and put it after Bill Russell, but I was kind of nervous doing it because I know Bill Russell is not that popular of a player. He is an all-time great. He's the greatest winner in NBA history, 11 championships, but he's not that popular of a player. So, you know, you guys got to understand for YouTube, you want popular players if you're doing NBA player videos. You're not going to do players that aren't that popular because who wants to watch a player that's not, you know, really known obviously people know who bill russell is but he played in the 60s and you know i it was a long time ago most people don't don't do nba research and go back and actually watch film back then but let me tell you bill russell was before his time dude was a freak athlete if you watch actual film of him dude was jumping over people getting layups getting like straight up hurdling them and laying the ball in dude was getting snatch blocks before even people before block shots were even really like a thing, they didn't even record them. He was getting snatch blocks. He was going up pinning dudes on the backboard like the dude was before his time. And in my opinion, deserves everyone's respect in terms of looking at all-time great basketball players. He has to be on the list, 100%. And a lot of people are going to say, oh, but the NBA's got way better since then. Of course. Oh, he wouldn't, have, he wouldn't be doing that if he was in the NBA today. Y'all have to realize, if he was in the NBA today, he would have today's training methods. He would have adapted to today's game dude was an all-time great when he played if you take him and throw him into the league today he's gonna have all the updated modern technology to train with and whatnot you know what i mean but listen bill russell builds six nine pure defense pie chart i could drop the actual build if you guys want to see how i actually made him but listen six nine all defensive pie chart center ridiculous the athleticism is there the defensive stats are there as you can see you can still knock down shots with them. I wouldn't recommend if you're looking for a shooting build to make this, but even with this build, you can knock down shots, contact dunks, like big man contacts, elite contacts, pro contacts, everything you could want, man. The center build is one of a kind, super unique. You saw, you saw all the clips, all the snatch blocks, all the green threes, all the contact dunks. 
it can do it all. I got one more clip. I just, I didn't really know how to put this into the video. But look, if Supreme breaks this dude, dots me in the corner. They're not even guarding me because they don't think I can shoot. And it's big greens, man. But hopefully y'all enjoyed the video, man. Drop a like. Subscribe if you guys are new. I'll talk to y'all in the next one. I'm out. Peace.